नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज क्वेश्चन नंबर टू पॉइंट टू जीरो हियर इट सेट ए फाइव परसेंट सोल्यूशन बाय मास ऑफ केन शुगर एंड वॉटर हैज अ फ्रीजिंग पॉइंट ऑफ टू सेवेंटी वन कैलवेन कैलकुलेट द फ्रीजिंग पॉइंट ऑफ अ फाइव परसेंट ग्लूकोज एंड वॉटर इफ द फ्रीजिंग पॉइंट ऑफ प्योर वॉटर इज टू सेवेंटी The question is for freezing point, so let's write the formula. Delta T F is equal to K F into W B divided by W A into M into thousand. All right. So now we have to check what all values are given to us. In this case, there's a freezing point given to us. Two freezing points. So we can write that your T F. Is going to be two seventy one Kelvin, and T F naught is going to be two seventy three point one five Kelvin. Delta T F is going to be T F naught minus T F. T F naught is two seventy three point one five Kelvin minus two seventy one Kelvin, which is equal to two point one five Kelvin. So that's delta T F. Next, we need to see is wherever we have A, we are going to have a solvent, and wherever we have B, we are going to have as a solute. So now, let's see what values we get. We can say that we have five percent of the uh, solution by mass. So when you say five percent of solution by mass, weight of the solute is five grams, and weight of the solvent is going to be since its percentage is hundred minus five, that will give ninety five grams. and we also need to calculate what is the molar mass of the cane sugar cane sugar formula is going to be c12 h22 o11 now this is going to be 12 into 12 because 12 atoms into atomic mass of carbon which is 12 plus 1 into 22 plus 11 into 16 when we simplify this you will get 342 grams that's going to be the molar mass now let's substitute all these values in the question but what is asked to us to calculate is the free calculate the freezing point of 5% of glucose that's what is asked so here we can calculate it as freezing point constant so we have to write down kf is equal to when we rearrange the formula kf is equal to Delta T F into W A into M into thousand divided by W B. Delta T F is here two point one five Kelvin into W A is here ninety five grams into molar mass which is three forty two grams into thousand divided by W B is going to be five grams. Gram and gram will get cancelled. This is going to be. One three point nine seven Kelvin kilogram per mole. That's going to be the answer for this.